Hi y'all! Um, I kind of seen a video and it was about a Christmas tumbler and I decided to make my own version of it. I'm doing a frozen version. So what you're going to need is tumbler. I've already put a bit of salt in so I could see if it would work and it will. Salt and the characters of whatever you're going to use. I'm going to try different ones and see what they look like. Um, I've also got a little Christmas tree to go in the background and a little flower. So yeah, um, I'm super excited to see what this looks like. I've never actually tried it further than just what's in there. From what I've seen, they used about up to there and then did Christmas decorations. Obviously I want this to be frozen, so I'm going to do frozen decorations. So, I'm not going to teach you how to like pour salt. So I'm, I'm just going to kind of... I'm taking you on. This is 750 grams of salt. If I need more, I can pick more up later on. So yeah, I was like really excited to do this video. That's kind of why I still look a mess. Right, make sure you do level it out unless you are going to try and do what I'm going to try and do. Um, I did have more characters but I did have them all lined up on the next to my band merch and my drumsticks fell off. So when my drumsticks fell off I lost most of my stuff. Right, so 750, 750 grams even of salt gone. So all you can see is just normal table salt and this is what it looks like. It is quite heavy, I'm not going to lie. So it's best if you probably don't give it to small children. So we're going to use Queen Elsa up on the top. And I'm going to have it so there's a gap on either way. So it does look like she's just facing out. Then we're going to have Olaf. He looks like he's just running up the mountain. Oh gosh. Princess Anna. <laughs> Olaf keeps sliding. Right, now the only problem with Kristoff is that he doesn't stand. So, to compromise this solution. Oh gosh, Anna's just fell over and so has Kristoff. To come. Right, I'm going to try using Big Al Anna and put her in, but have her so she looks a little bit further down, if that makes any sense. And apparently not because like my tumblers just decided to go all over. Right. She looks massive compared to Kristoff. Oh sugar. See this is kind of why I was a bit nervous about doing this is the fact that I kind of didn't know how it would go. This is my first shot at it. As you see in the tumbler was literally had barely any salt when I did start it. So I'm just going to put it down for two seconds just while I can get Anna into position. And then we'll do stuff. Yeah, I think we're going to go for Little Anna because Big Anna makes it look a bit out of proportion. So these are washable figures, thank gosh. Crystal. Right, so I'll just kind of show you what I've done. So. 
obviously it's like the North Mountain it's based upon. So that's what we're going to try and work with is the North Mountain scenery. So everything's not going to be perfect obviously and it is quite hard to do but we are getting there. And I don't want it to seem like it's overrun with Christoph's family. So they're just going to kind of blend into the background. Right, if I can get the flower to move, that would be great. Yeah, I don't like that. Let's put it next to the tree. Right, so I've got it so it looks like they are hiking up the mountain. And so it's more of a Christmas scenery. But the only problem is, with it being sand, uh, salt even, not sand, and everything being so light and movable, I'm going to have him lie down so it looks like he fell over. Right. And this is what it looks like. So, what do you guys think? I really like it myself. It is a little bit fussy to do. And I think you can do, like, obviously other sceneries and other backgrounds if you used grass or if you used a different way my Christmas trees leaning over um, obviously you use different things you're gonna get different effects let's move out so actually we'll put her up next there so Kristoff has to stand up against the thing Elsa shouldn't be leaning over um, marshmallow would look great but I'm still trying to find where they all went um, I've got a couple of Kristoff's families in there so they look like they fell over in the process of playing in the snow. There's a Christmas tree, um, Kristoff, Olaf, Elsa and his family. So yeah, this is my Christmas tumbler. So you just kind of put the lid on top and there we go. So you can see there's still the room so you can look in. There can be plenty of light, the snow looks like it's going around the side. You could paint pretty pictures on there of like um, snowflakes and stuff like that. So yeah, um, don't forget to thumb up, subscribe and tell me what you think. No, it's pretty simple. All you need is some frozen characters or some Christmas decorations to put in there. Some salt and a tumbler. I picked this tumbler up in B&M's so you kind of know it wasn't that expensive. Um, so yeah, tell me what you think, don't forget to thumb up, subscribe and comment below and don't forget to show me what you make if you do make one. Okay, I love you all, bye bye.